Hey Great Dramas, Greg Dillon here from GreatDramas.com and today we're having a look at William Grant & Sons Rare Cask Reserves. So this is blended Scotch whiskey aged a minimum of 21 years old and it is from three silent distilleries. So distilleries that are no longer producing and therefore you can't uh, buy any newer spirit, only the stocks that the, the big companies still have lying around uh, ready for special releases and blending like this. So this is selected release number two uh, age 21, bottle number 948, 42.8% um, ABV, and it is blend of Ladyburn, which uh, was ghosted in 1975, Inverleven, ghosted in 1992, and of course Dumbarton, ghosted in 2002. Um, it comes in a rather elegant uh, slide out bit of packaging here, very nice. Um, and yeah. Let's have a quick look. It's quite an interesting idea, blending three different dead distilleries together to see what will happen and to you know, commercialise that in, instead of single cask or uh, kind of annual releases, as you will, from the likes of uh, Port Ellen, for example, Diageo special releases every year. So I'm intrigued by this one. And especially for the price. I think it retails around 100 to 120 pounds, different websites online. On the nose, we've got lots of cloves, uh, kind of cinnamon, cardamom as well, uh, quite spicy. An underlying fruity vanilla note as well, which is like a lovely little wrap. And quite muted, quite calm, nothing too kind of in your face. Um, as similar to the packaging, it's quite an elegant nose actually. On the palate, a lot more oak influence than I'd have imagined. Um, very sweet vanilla oak, um, hints of char coming through, maybe a light to a medium char um, is hitting the back of my tongue right now. But again, really muted, really calm, a good uh, sitting whiskey, not one to kind of labour over for hours and hours, but a very nice premium whiskey to you know share with friends or or just sit after a hard day at work. Nose opens up a bit more after you've sipped it, adding even more of those spices and those cloves and uh, cardamom I mentioned earlier. Mm. Very buttery on the palate. Ice and uh, lots of butter, lots of almost um, melted butter that is. Um, unsalted and all just kind of wraps together to form a very nice whiskey. Cheers!